Okay, hello dear friends. Good evening. <laughs> so this is San Francisco Museum, De Young Museum. Okay, hello dear friends. So here I am at the museum, and、uh, there is nothing better. Than these classic arts, for me, it's all relative. I know, for some people, they may like modern art, abstract art, that express themselves more. But I always find home in this classic, beautiful landscape art. For some reason, I just so much attract into it because there is a skill, and not only there is a skill, there is a, there is poetry in these paintings. Every time I look at them. I see new poem. I see new emotion. Not I see new emotion. It evoke the poetry in my heart, and、uh, it brings up stories. So these couple of days, I was、uh, listening to the. The video talk, and uh, <coughs> and uh, the professor said, every time we make data, we manipulate. Even we do not manipulate, we have our own idea, and、uh, so it may not be true, but.、Uh, What I am thinking about it is a different story. In front of this painting, there are many stories. Everyone can make their own story, and I have my story because I have my own agenda. I see the darkness, and I see the silver line. Of the cloud, and it evokes my current situation. I am just coming out of a, a struggle with、uh, with weakness, with my own、uh, body condition, health condition, and I got over it. Not totally over it, but I do so much feel the hope of getting better, and I start to see the cloud, and this cloud is the hope of sunshine, because there is sun behind it. Although it is covered, there is a sun, there is brightness, there is warmth, there is light, and、uh, behind this darkness, there is light, and even within this darkness, there are different layers of darkness. There is the despair of darkness. There is、uh, the hopeless darkness that you are totally lost, and there is the darkness where you can see some light, some color, and you can see the dimension of the subject. And through the darkness, we can see our life. We can see our situation. 
we can see everything we are in more clearly if we are completely in the bright light we will be blind our eyes will be blind by the brightness of the light and we could not see the darkness but when we are inside the darkness we see things better we see the different dimension of things and it is the same as when we are in an inferior situation we become humble and in the humble situation we can see things better we can see the different dimension of the subject we will not be blinded because there is no extra light to to blind us to shade us such a beautiful I'm sorry I still use beautiful such a magnificent painting and it's so tender so soft there is nothing coming out suddenly there is nothing that uh, that break up this harmony it's completely harmonious but there is such strength contrast and uh, feeling emotion empathy in this painting it's it it evokes so much of our own feeling because when we put ourselves inside the painting we are part of it we are part of it the same as a piece of rock We are part of it, the same as uh, a little branch. We are part of it, same as uh, same as uh, a piece of a falling leaf. We are part of it, the same as the huge mountain wherever you put yourself in you get a feeling of where you are and uh, technically i am so impressed by this uh, soft tender painting because when we do painting or when I do painting I just put too much color or too much contrast but this painting without much contrast everything is harmonious it harmonious under the sun with a little bit uh, of warmth you can see this is sunset the beginning of the evening the sunset and everything is soft warm and dark but there is so much layers of color in this actually this
this camera seems getting better color than our eyes. I love the tenderness of this painting. The humbleness of this painting. The softness and uh, the, the generosity of this painting and the kindness of this painting. Do 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 do.